in part, uh, we unlocked a lot of opportunities for our business growth and uh, in 60% growth, which we achieved since implementation, it was a big part of, uh, let's say, enabler from uh, uh, from supply chain side. And one of the big ones was planning side here. In terms of customer uh, service, a lot of, a lot of uh, development went on the customer side. Lots of uh, modern trade retailers grew more and more aggressively in the market. And of course, their demand for, for service uh, increased. We realized that uh, once we start measuring it and after implementation of uh, Anaplan, we went uh, actually 15 percentage points uh, upwards in, in service level of the main uh, suppliers due to reduction of out of stocks, making sure we do have uh, right plans uh, on SQ level in, in a very specific channel. And sometimes even with a specific retailer, we have a joint business planning process with, uh, with the largest retailer in the country. And again, the last but not the least, uh, with 2000 SKUs and warehouses, uh, uh, rapid business growth, it was very, and, and a lot of novelties that our partners really wanted to introduce in the growing market. It was very difficult to, uh, to analyze and keep, uh, keep up with the stock levels. So we had quite, uh, quite large uh, write-offs which usually came from uh, uh, from certain events on specific suppliers or were stuck in uh, in the warehouse in the regions in the warehouse where it was not moving so i think we uh, we've reduced it uh, more than twice and we're still above zero which is not desirable but uh, we are much much better than we used to be and uh, for us even this sum alone for for the first uh, 12 months it more than uh, paid for our implementation license cost and actually the, the entire project cost.